Do you like food? Well, I do. And we certainly need food on a daily basis. But did you know that more than one quarter of the world population depends on food also as a source of income? Especially in developing countries, many of the poorest people depend on agriculture and food production as their main livelihood. Global Food is a research and training program at the University of Göttingen where we analyze issues of food production, food distribution and consumption from a very global perspective. Typical research questions that we address are how do global food consumption preferences change over time and how does this affect international trade and poverty? Or how can smallholder farmers in developing countries be better linked to high value markets in Europe? A food value chain starts with agricultural production in farmers' fields and then extends over traders and processors and retailers up to the level of consumption. But we cannot analyze these stages of the value chain in isolation when we want to understand the big picture. For instance, if food retailers in Europe implement the new food quality standard, uh, then this can have major implications for international trade and also for small farmers in Africa. In the Global Food Program, we are trying to understand these backward and forward linkages and come up with policy recommendations of how global food value chains can be made more sustainable. In addition to the research we do in the Global Food Program, we also pay heavy emphasis on the training part, training of young researchers to make them fit for international careers. We have a very diverse team of young researchers and they get the chance to do data collection in different countries and to cooperate with leading researchers and experts around the world. More than 50 young researchers have already obtained their PhD degree in the Global Food Programme and are now holding exciting positions in different national and international organizations. We are extremely proud of our young researchers but you should get your own impression by listening to what they can say about their own research projects.